It's early October, 1932. A man is wandering the streets of the Parisian district of Montparnasse in the driving rain, a revolver in his pocket. This is Man Ray, one of the most influential surrealist artists of the 20th century, world-renowned for his groundbreaking avant-garde photography. After several years of intense creation and passion, the woman he loves desperately is leaving him and he is distraught. Lee Miller has reserved a one-way ticket for America and in a few days' time she will set sail for New York, ready to embark on the next chapter in her remarkable life. Miller herself would later confess that while she had the look of an angel, on the inside she was a demon. And her relationship with Man Ray was just such a juxtaposition. 17 years her senior, Man Ray was persuaded to take on Miller as an apprentice, despite his insistence that he did not take on students. Soon after, she became his assistant, his lover, his muse, and his obsession. Miller became a highly accomplished photographer in her own right, and together they pioneered the rediscovery of the photographic technique of solarization. This volatile and catalytic relationship was to result in some of the most powerful work of their respective careers and help shape the course of modern art. This is just one example of the captivating stories of love and inspiration brought to life in muses, women who inspire, from Nancy Cunard's immortalization in her work of her innumerable admirers and lovers, including Ernest Hemingway and T.S. Eliot, to the explosive relationship between Salvador Dali and his Russian-born siren Gala, the author peels back a veil of intrigue, shrouding some 25 19th and 20th century relationships to reveal the nature of these creative partnerships and how they have changed the face of our cultural history.